What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another Golden Dice commentary by Flockton. I'm going to give this a shot because Jack made me do it. So we'll see how this goes. So we got Vader versus Sabine. And Vader doing the Stormtrooper. And then we got Sabine playing Sabine. Vader action. Ping one to Sabine, one to the base. One thing I've learned is when you're playing against Vader, don't drop a one cost. Because if they drop a one cost, they're just going to kill it. So always look for your opening hand against the Vader to have a, at least two health. Turn one. So Sabine has the initiative. Let's see. Let's see what he does here. Let's see what Jack does. He's got a lay, it looks like, in his hand. I forget what they're talking about. They're talking about something. Sabine gonna smack the face for, th for two. There we go. The combo with the Snow Trooper Lieutenant. Five to the base from Vader. Vader can do one to one. Sabine takes the initiative. All right. One thing we always keep forgetting is Sabine comes out turn four, the earliest one. So let's see if Brian has anything to do with Sabine when she comes out. Other characters you can sometimes wait a little bit to take you know to draw something that could take care of them with sabine you kind of need to pick it up basically in your opening hand you need to have an open hand to be able to deal with sabine or she could really start doing some damage if you've got nothing to either exhaust or just flat out kill so sabine aggro smacks the face interceptor it's gonna kill jack's space unit So it looks like Vader's out aggroing the aggro. We got five more damage on, on board for Vader. Oh, he's got that uh, A-Wing. Yeah, I hate that card. Safe to play it now. Nothing in space that can take care of it. So he's hoping to take the initiative and be able to do three damage next turn with it. Oh, there we go. Got a board state, yeah. And Vader has no more resources. So basically, Sabine come out and do whatever Sabine wants to do. So you pretend it trades. Sabine does the action. One to each base. Deploy Sabine. Brian's got to sit there and just take it to face. I think he took, probably took initiative. I think he forgot to grab the initiative token. I'm gonna yell at him in the background. You know, take the initiative token. Yep, there he goes. He grabs it. Okay, so Jack went up to five resources. He generally says he likes to stick with four, sometimes going to five. He must have something in his hand that's at least a five drop or a good combo of a three, two drop that he wants to play. So interesting to see what he goes with here. Looks like he does three to Sabine. And they're deciding which Sabine, because there's both Sabines are out right now. Brian decided to go after the leader unit, Sabine. Sabine's back's two for the face. 
and Sabina Aggro and a lot of damage. Both have five resources still, still full on resources. I really feel like Brian should think about attacking with the Interceptor. Take out the A-Wing before it starts to do damage, because it has Raid, but he goes with the 5th Brother. That's like really good, the ambush ability on 5th Brother. Takes out the one Sabine. Ambushes, takes out the other Sabine. So that's a really good play. Able to take out two characters with one play with ECL. And now he's taking the three from the A-Wing, which I think... He made the better play anyway. Jack throwing at a Sabine. Yo, they make fun of me all the time for doing that. And then once I stop doing it, they just start doing it. I don't know what all the talk is. You kind of get forget in the moment. You know, it's a unit. You sometimes just throw it in there. You could discard pile after it gets killed. It's kind of what you're used to. Yep, so that's take it out. Only takes one damage. Brian want to take initiative. Instead of, I think, dealing the damage with Vader's ability. So he won initiative. Let's see who does. He has his six resources. He can't get Vader unless he can get one more resource. But I don't think he really can right now unless he has resupply. He's going to take the trade. And there's another. Oh, I hate that card. So good. Got five to the base. Sabine's ability, one to one. He's got Brian still has six resources. What does he have? I don't see really what's in his hand. He's gonna play one for a stormtrooper. Okay. Jack has three resources. I don't see what is in his hand. I might have missed it. Jack thinks something's coming, and he feels like I think he has to kill Vader now, potentially. I think he's thinking of all the cards that are in Jack's hand, or Brian's hands. They go to the next round. Yeah, Brian out to just go to the next round. Because he does have board control. With not a lot of health, so he does need to put more pressure on Sabine here. Brian's probably worried about a surprise strike here. Could that be lethal? OB. Just does it all to that. There we go. Yep, he was, he was worried about the surprise strike. Not sure if Jack even had it, but it's definitely a worry to be worried about. Jack does have Leia. He's probably saving Leia to exhaust something. Either Vader or Fifth Brother. Uh, I forget what they're talking about. But yeah, so Overwhelm Garage gets plus two, plus two. 
So fifth brother has six HP, so three needs to be done. Yeah, he's only at seven. Fifth brother only does seven. For lethal. I forget what that card is, but it is deals damage for every hero card. I think. I don't know. He's just a little shy because he wanted to be within one so he can Sabine one to one. But I think what they're going to do here is he's going, since Overwhelming Barrage gives plus two, plus two, he's going to do the on ability, on attack ability. He's going to basically do one to fifth brother and do kill his Stormtrooper to allow him to go up one more damage, and that'll be lethal for eight damage. So that's what he does. Yep, he attacks his own. And then is able to do the eight damage that's needed. And that's the video.